Hello there, guys. Welcome back to a short online tutorial. Today, we're based in Adobe Photoshop, and it's your good friend Jack from Blue Sky Graphics back again to show you some really cool stuff. What I want to do today, guys, is show you how to create this plastic bubble wrap effect in Adobe Photoshop. A really cool idea that you could use to cover some album, album covers, some magazine covers, a really cool idea that you can implement. What I'm going to do is take our top layer here and press backspace to remove and start off with our original uh, image. And what I have on another tab here is a pre-downloaded bubble wrap uh, uh, JPEG, which I'm just going to simply click and drag over here onto this artboard and just cover this whole artboard here. I'm just going to use a shortcut Command T on Mac or Control T on Windows just to resize and cover the whole artboard there like so. Okay, so simply to that layout, what I'm now going to do is come through and change the blending mode to screen. And there you can see it's really sort of coming to life now. But what I want to do is I want to see some of the lady's face a little bit more clearer. So I'm just going to add a layer mask on here. And I'm going to use our polygonal lasso tool. And I'm just going to come through, maybe zoom out a little bit, just give me some space. And we're going to say something like... That. And now with that layer mask selected, all I need to do now is right click on there, fill and black. There we go. And then the final little step that I want to do is apply a little drop shadow to our bubble wrap layer. So just double click on it, drop shadow, which you can obviously manipulate and change and whatever here to fit the your requirements. And there you have it, guys. That's how you create that bubble wrap effect in Adobe Photoshop. If you're interested in finding out more about the school, the courses that we offer, please take a look at our website at bluesgirlgraphics.co.uk. Thank you very much, guys. Take care, and I'll see you next time.